Hey everybody, this is Alpha Zero at the service right now. I'm going to do a review on a new episode of Zankyo no Terra, and honestly, this episode was pretty, pretty crazy and interesting to be in my own eyes right now, because right now, like, um, everything seems to be revealed in the end, and no wonder, like, um, never thought it's going to be happening like this. So, if anything else, um, I'll just get, um, started right now and right away, because, like, um, time is limited, and I need to get going very soon, and so forth. So, if anything else, like, um, the episode starts off where, like, um, let me see here, um, well, after the, where Shibazaki ends up talking, and then talking to someone, and it has an episode preview of last week, you know, and then later on, 12 is gone to go help, like, um, Lisa, and everything revealed about this Athena plan project whatsoever has been told out already, like, many kids have been test subjects, 26 of them. Under the age of five, I believe. I'm thinking in my mind, what the fuck is that? Like, some crazy damn experiment to kill kids. Not cool. It is not cool to do that. I'm serious. And later on, as the episode keeps going, and the information's going, going and given, it's like, only, only one kid survived and two others to escape. That's nine and twelve, and five is a survivor. And later on, the... The old man that they that Shibazaki and his friend interrogate, like um, done this project and has been has been like um, coming on until now and says like um, if those two are alive, then I'm pretty sure they don't got much time. They may not really have. They did not have. They may not have much time to live or something. Seventeen years old, he says they be. So pretty much everything seem, se seems to be seems to be. In, in place right now. Now we understand why um, 12 says that's the reason why I don't have much time. And I'm thinking in my mind, holy motherfucking shit, no wonder, because like these drugs that the kids took around this age or something, they are going to die soon. And I'm thinking in my mind, what? That's what the old man says. He says, if they're alive right now, they may not even have much time to live. And I'm going, like, what the fuck, dude? And then, 12 reaches where Lisa is in the first wheel and tries to disarm the bombs in time, you know? And later on, like, uh, it seems like 5 seems to be sick right now, you know? Like, she seems to be having a headache, and I'm thinking in my mind, this is not looking good, because, like, um, what the old man might be saying is true. Those kids that survived 5, 9, and 12 have been, um, don't got much time. And, and it shows it at where where um five is having a headache or something and later on she and later on like um lisa apologizes for everything but 12 says you don't have to apologize anymore it's my fault i'm the one that should apologize i'm the one that talked to you i'm the one that took you for a ride i'm the one that took you in so and so forth and i just go like oh man dude and later on like there's a phone ring about like um well, five contacts twelve on the first one and says, "I'll make you a trade. You tell me where the bomb is, and I will stop the bomb myself." This was a difficult decision because he will only betray betray nine in the end. But she said, "But five says you already betrayed nine. So what's the point of you trying to hide it now, huh?" And I think in my mind, "Holy fucking shit, dude!" And just when it was about to explode, oh man, he says it's a school D twelve locker and. 12 felt hecka guilty while the others are trying to find the bomb, but 9 manages to get it. But later on, like, um, it seems like 5's worse before the end of the episode says, Don't let him get away and capture him. And then she faints. And I think in my mind, okay, this isn't good right here. Because right now, like, um, because right now, so far, the police's job or the USA police job is to find the atomic bomb or the plutonium whatsoever, you know? And I'm thinking in my mind, Holy shit, I don't know what's gonna happen, but all but this episode was really good and interesting. Y'all have to give this a watch and take a look at it and know what I'm talking about. Um I only gave you a short short review of it because like I don't got much time and I can't have all the information in my head after watching it the the first time. And I could watch it a second time but I don't got time for that. Right now like um it's almost like ten thirty and I have to like and get going to school, you know. Give this episode a watch and find out, like, more information and backstory. I'll be honest with you. I think this is one of my, um, honestly, like, uh, many people say this is, like, a very good series and could be the top so far. I have to agree. I may have to agree. 
at some point, you know, some things take me off, but you know, like, um, this thing has a lot of, like, um, development into it, give this episode a watch, I'll have it in the li description link below, and then you guys will know what the hell is going on, and you will understand it better when you watch it than me explaining it, I mean, this is just my review and my thoughts on, on it, okay, I'm not observe people, I gotta get going, and I'll see y'all on my, on my next video, okay, later, peace out, bye.